Not really sure how common this problem is, whether this will be helpful or not, but I've had this tractor for a couple months now. It's been running great. We got it kind of cleaned up. We inherited this from a family member. And before we got it, it's been sitting for about maybe three to five years. Changed the oil, did all that sort of stuff. And it was running great for a while. It ran out of gas for the first time and I refilled it. Um, and then immediately, immediately after that, it would not run straight. Basically, it would vary in RPM, struggling to run basically. Um, so I suspected that maybe it got down towards the end of the tank, it sucked up some garbage, and I think that's actually what happened. And just wanted to, to, to put on YouTube exactly what I did to fix it, and so far it's been running great. <clears throat> so, I don't know why if this was the way it was when it came new, but um, there's two filters on here, and I noticed the filters were dry. Um, you can see now there's a little bit of fuel in here. I've done the repair. So, of course, once you notice that it's dry and there's fuel in the tank, that leads to there's not fuel getting to the engine. So I thought I would replace the fuel filter anyways, pull that off, and there was basically no gas whatsoever uh, kind of getting through the line. My guess is these lines probably need to be all replaced. Maybe the ethanol is eating uh, them. There's probably garbage in the tank. I'm not going to worry about it. It's not a a Ferrari or anything, but um, anyways, to the point of the video, what I did to fix it was I took out the old filter, I bought a new one, um, and what I did is took a airline, I took an airline like this, and just basically put it into the tube and just gently, um, you know, blew some air into the line, and you could actually hear it after a second kind of blow bubbles in the uh, the tank. So I knew from that standpoint uh, it was clear. Uh, one side, uh, side note or word of caution is as soon as I did that and removed the air gun, water, or gas started shooting out. I didn't have anything here <laughs> to, uh, to stop it. So when you do it, if you do this, be prepared for fuel to come pouring out. I think it basically created pressure into So luckily, I had this within reach. I was able to grab it with my foot or slide it over with my foot and uh, stuck that in there to stop the flow so I can go get some tools. So just a word of caution, um, if you do that, uh, gas will come shooting back out. I suspect it was due to I blew air into the tank, created pressure, and the pressure uh, uh, came back out. Anyways, once I did that, it ran fine. Let's fire it up.